So hi everybody, I'm here with Rob Fink from Big Drop. You may have heard us talk about his new milk stout, which has got the wonderful word in front of it, chocolate milk stout. So um, I thought I'd introduce him to you today and he could tell you a little bit about his beer. So let's have a look at it. Here it is. Beautiful. So tell us why you made this. Uh, so last year I uh, stopped drinking for about six or seven months um, and the one beer that was missing uh, that I couldn't find in the, the low and no alcohol beers was a stout. And I love stout, it's my favourite type of beer. And so I decided to have a stab at making a low alcohol stout. So what are alcoholic stouts? Is a Guinness a stout? A Guinness would be considered a stout. Um, it's not, you would usually find a stout in a good beer pub. Uh, it's not a hugely popular style of drink, although it's making something of a comeback. Um, but I think because it's not one of the most popular uh, styles of beer. People haven't made low alcohol versions of it up until now. Okay, so shall we try it? Let's do that. So it's um, 0.5% or below, up to 0.5%. Cool, let's have a go. Oh, uh, look at this, look at this. It's like, it reminds me of um, black treacle, the colour. So. There are, there's a lot of dark malt in here yeah. for the colour. Um, it's got a very complex uh, malt bill. So you've got not only barley, but you've got oats in there and rye as well. And it smells, it smells like I would expect um, a, a stouty beer to yeah. smell, because I've smelled Guinness, but better. My wife it's says it smells like an espresso martini. It does, so it's got a slightly coffee smell. Yep, there's coffee. A slightly chocolate, a definitely a chocolatey smell, which for me is, is the most important thing. There are cocoa nibs in here, so there is chocolate <gasps> That's, in so here. So it's middle class as well. It's middle class. <laughs> it's not just low alcohol, it's middle class. It's cocoa nibs. Now, some of you may know I'm not a beer drinker, and so I'm always, um, I'm always a bit dubious about me tasting these things. But to me, this is... Um, this feels like a treat. It feels luxurious, and and it's really bitter. So if you like your bitter chocolate and you like your bitter coffee, then this definitely hits the mark. And for me, funny enough, I would have this as a shot to go with my dinner uh, or with my dessert. That sounds um, like so, a good idea. Um, so that um, and it does feel like a, a treat. So if you're trying to replace your normal alcoholic drink with something that doesn't feel like an everyday drink, I would certainly get this to have with my meal. This is, this is. Ah, so um, Yus is just waving and saying calories because obviously he's on a diet. Uh, um, and um, tell me about the calories in this. So this is approximately uh, about 115 calories in a bottle. Okay, and so you, you're waiting for tests to come back to We're confirm. We're waiting for tests the... to confirm, uh, but what we've done in the, in the brew house is that that's, uh, that's about what it is in a bottle. Um, so it is... It is a luxurious, decadent drink. Um, I like it with chocolate in itself, with a chocolate pudding. And chocolate goes with everything, do you know this? Chocolate right. goes with everything. <laughs> um, and we also suggest barbecue meats as well. You know, it's, mm. it's got that. Definitely, because it would really play off really well against those smoky flavours. Absolutely. It's got a little hints of vanilla in it. Um, and I want to order some more. I'm just sending... I keep... Um, uh, sending drinks to my friend at the minute who's going through a difficult time and going, oh, she'll love this, I need to get some of this for her as well. Perfect, thanks for bringing it in. It's available now? It is available now. Yeah, and you can buy it in Dry Drinker. And don't forget, if you're a Club Soda uh, member or you're p a part of our page, there's a discount code, which is Club Soda VIP. If you go to drydrinker.com, you can buy it. And thanks for coming in today, Rob, and no sharing problem. that with us. And um, I'm really excited. And I know that Charlie and Lucy now want to try some. So we'll leave it there. Glad Bye. you like it. Thanks.